Hello soldiers, welcome back to our YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to solve Alma Vitter's module 3 that is mathematics for ML and today's topic is summarizing data and this is fifth assignment in this series. So let's begin. And problem one is write a function which calculates the mode of a list of numbers. If there are two modes in the data set, it should return both. So what I'm telling, I'm just going to tell you what is mode. Mode is the thing that, for example, in this data set, we are having all the numbers. So the number which is repeated the most, that is mode. Okay, basically that is a mode. That's what we are going to find out. If there are more number of modes in that particular data set, we should return all of them. Okay, that's our primary goal. For that purpose, I'm just going to import numpy as np. Then this is the function which we are creating. So in this function, you can just keep your eye on here. numpy dot np dot unique. Then I'm just going to do this thing. My array comma return counts equal to true. When I'm returning here, you can see np dot where frequency is equals to frequency dot max so that's what we are going to find out the number which has repeated the most that's what we need right so while printing here you can see we got these numbers as modes of this particular data set i think you got it now we are moving to problem number two perform outlier removal in the duration column of phone underscore data dot csv you can just get this phone underscore data dot csv from nilgiri cohort uh, in like not in nilgiri also if you are from your cohort also you can get this data set in data wrangling from module one there you will get this data set okay uh, plot the box plot or this plot outlier removal. So we are going to use this thing. This plot post outlier removal. So first I'm mounting my drive, then I'm giving the path of my data set. Here I'm just using the head to get the view of my data set. So and the first column is index, then date in date column we are having both a uh, date and time in duration column we are having the duration in item column i am having uh, data call in month column i am having month in network column i am having the network name vodafone idea airtel geo like that in network type mobile or data that's what we are having so we need to focus on only duration column right so here we are getting the quartile 1 quartile 2 quartile 3 quartile 4 to get these values easily i'll just show you the simplest way phone underscore df dot describe so now you will get so here you can see here 25th percentile is my first quartile 50th percentile is second quartile and 20, uh, 75th percentile is my third quartile then max is my like fourth quartile okay now you got i think here what we are going to do we are going to find intel inter quartile range into quartile range okay so that means quartile 3 minus quartile 4 this will remain same for any problem okay here we are calculating lower limit lower limit means quartile 1 minus 1.5 into inter quartile range upper limit means quartile 3 plus 1.5 into inter quartile range these two formulas will remain same so here we are filtering the data here duration less than upper limit and 
duration greater than lower limit so we are just plotting our this plot here you can see i'm using c bone you can see the chart okay so on y axis i'm having density on x axis i'm having duration so you can see duration is decreasing here so here it increased so that's it for now meet you in next video till then bye bye do subscribe to my youtube channel